Have you been trying to figure out how to transfer your listings on one eBay account over to another eBay account? Well, in this video, I'm going to show you how to do that. Hi guys, my name's Justin and I love teaching people here on YouTube how to sell on eBay and I go by the name Coach Commerce. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can easily transfer your listings quickly and effectively using a third party software because on eBay, eBay does not allow you to transfer your listings from one account to another account. There's no way to do it. But with a third party software, it's definitely doable. Now the software that I use is software called Inkfrog and you can find that software on inkfrog.com. Now I know what you're thinking. You're probably thinking, wait a minute, this guy is getting paid to publish this video. And I'm not, believe me, I'm not endorsed by Inkfrog. This is simply a product that I use all of the time to transfer listings from one store to another. So enough of me talking. I promise I'm going to keep this short and to the point and I'm going to jump right on over now to Inkfrog to show you how to do this process. But stay tuned until the end of the video because at the end I'm going to dive into some depth about why I use Inkfrog to transfer listings from one store to another because there are actually some really good seller benefits that can help you increase your profit margins and sell more on eBay if you use the strategies that I teach at the end of the video. Okay, so let's go ahead and jump over to Inkfrog on our web browser. Now if I go to inkfrog.com, the first thing you'll probably notice when you scroll around on the homepage is you're going to notice that there are multiple different subscription plans. Now before you go ahead and think, oh man, I've got to pay for this service, please realize there's a 14 day free trial. But if you want to transfer files regularly from store to store, um, you might want to consider one of the other packages. But like I said, I'm not encouraging you to use this site and, and pay for it. But that option is there if you're going to be transferring files from store to store often. So we're going to go ahead and click on the Get Started button. And when you click on Get Started, it's going to take you over to eBay. It's going to automatically take you there and it's going to ask you to sign in. Just go ahead and sign in to your account. All right, on the next page, it's gonna ask you to grant application access. Um, you can read the print, but you're gonna to have to agree if you wanna use the service. So go ahead and click I agree, and it's gonna take you to the next page. From here, you're gonna go ahead and provide your personal information, your email address that they can contact you at, and then whatever password you wanna use for the account. All right, once you provide your email address, you can tell you're at the Inkfrog dashboard, and of course, at the top, it shows you you have your 14-day trial. So you don't have to pay for anything. If you're wanting to transfer items, of course, you can use the trial and then cancel at any time. So now we're at the Inkfrog dashboard, and you'll see over here on the left-hand side, we have a few different menu options. Now, when we granted access to Inkfrog, it automatically connected the first eBay store that we had when we signed up to the account. And as you can see, my Coach Commerce eBay store, um, when I click on library, all of my eBay items in that store automatically populate to my listing library. And these are all my live listings that are currently on eBay. Now this is great because I already have one store connected, but if I'm wanting to transfer any items from this store over to a new store, I'm gonna have to go ahead and add that second store to my Inkfrog account. The way that I'm going to do that is I'm going to go over here to the eBay tab and when I click on that button it's going to bring down a drop down menu and at the very bottom you're going to see the settings tab. Go ahead and click on the settings tab and when that pops up you're going to want to go over to the accounts button. Click on the accounts tab and when that pops up you can tell that I already have the main account that I signed up with activated. Now in order to add items to another account or to transfer them over I have to add another eBay account. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over here and click on the Add eBay Account button. Now from here, what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and link your other eBay account. I'm not going to waste your time and show you the process because it's exactly the same as what I showed you to begin with with adding your first eBay account. So you're going to go ahead and add that account and then you're going to go back to your Inkfrog library. To get to your Inkfrog library, you're going to go over to the side menu bar again and right underneath the Home tab, you're going to click on Library. This is going to bring up your entire eBay catalog. Now all the listings that you have active on your accounts are going to be here on this page. Now you can filter your listings by clicking the drop down menu and by selecting your listings by type. Um, there's all different type of settings that you can use to sort through and, and categorize your listings. But um, I'm going to go ahead now and show you how you would change one listing at a time over to your eBay store. 
And then after that, I'll go ahead and show you how to change your listings in bulk if you want to move one entire store over to another store all at once. But we'll start with how to transfer a single listing if you only want to transfer listings one at a time. To do that, you're going to go ahead and click on whatever listing you're selecting. Here I'll go ahead and click on this vintage video camera. And when that comes up, you'll notice right away that there's an eBay account icon right there or a little eBay account click down menu. Now when I click on that eBay account drop down menu, however many eBay accounts I have linked to my Inkfrog account are going to show up here in this menu. Now if I want to move one listing to another account, all I have to do here is select which account that I want to move it to. For example, if I had this listing active in the Tweed Stone store and I wanted to move it over to the Fancy Rock store, all I would do is go down to the Fancy Rock store and then make sure it's highlighted and then go all the way up to the top corner and click save. It's that simple. To move one item to another account, you just change the account and click save. Now you might be thinking, that's great, but I want to move my entire store, not one item at a time. I want everything moved over all at once. Is that possible? And the good news is, yes, it's definitely possible. You can bulk edit everything in your entire store and move it from one store to another all at one time. Now to bulk edit your items on Inkfrog, it's actually just as simple as editing them individually. You're going to go ahead and go back to your library tab and when you're back in your library, once again, you can filter your listings by type, however you prefer. But um, at the very top, you'll notice after you filter them, there's a little checkbox that will enable you to select all of your listings. And of course, if there are any that you don't want to select, you can go ahead and click them off individually. But whenever you have all of your listings that you want to transfer over to your new store, you're going to go ahead and look over in the top right corner at the bulk actions button. Go ahead and click that button and it's going to open up a drop down menu. Then you're going to go down to the very bottom where it says listing actions. Go ahead and click on that button. When you click on that button, you're going to see another menu and at the very top of that, it's going to say assign eBay account. Go ahead and click on that button. From here, you'll be shown a list of all of the listings that you selected along with a drop down to select a new eBay account for each listing. You can change these one by one by moving them to a variety of new eBay accounts, or you can use the change all row at the very top of the page to associate all of the listings shown to a new eBay account all in one button click. All right, now that I've showed you how to transfer listings from one eBay account to another using Inkfrog, you might be wondering why even bother transferring eBay listings in the first place? Well, I can tell you a couple of reasons why I like using this software to transfer listings from different accounts. The first reason why is if you've been an eBay seller for any period of time, you know the eBay search engine loves fresh listings on an account. The more new listings you have, the more that the algorithm picks up that you're an active eBay user and you're going to make more sales. So you can kind of trick and game eBay search algorithm into thinking that your store is listing new items by putting your items from one store and moving them over into another. So it's kind of like a little eBay hack. And secondly, another reason why you may need to move eBay items from one account to another is if you purchase a lot of items to resell from another eBay reseller. A lot of times I'll buy eBay businesses that are going out of business and I'll transfer them over to my account. If the person that was already selling them on eBay has them active on their eBay account, if you get the permission and then log in under their account, you can transfer all of those listings to your account without spending all of the tedious hours of listing them on your end. Now I'm sure there are other really great reasons why you would probably want to transfer listings from one account to another. Maybe you found this video and you have a different reason in mind. If you do, I'd love to hear what it is. Drop me a comment down below and tell me how you plan on transferring your eBay listings and the reason why you're doing it. Also, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up down below. It'll really help this video out and it'll definitely help me grow as a YouTuber. If you're interested in watching more YouTube videos like this one about how to buy and sell things on eBay, please consider subscribing to my channel if you're not already a subscriber. Thank you guys for watching and until next time, happy selling on eBay. Bye everyone.